Hello, this is Alice Summers from Canaan United Methodist Church. I'm presenting a children's message entitled, Let Justice Roll. Please pray with me. God of love, mercy, and justice, with a thankful heart, we celebrate a new year, a time of promise. Thank you for all of your blessings. Help us to do your will, to be more kind and more loving. We pray for more peace and more love in our lives and in the world. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The scripture for the message is, But let justice roll on like a river, righteousness like a never-failing stream. And that comes from Amos, 5th chapter, 24th verse. During the past year, we heard the word justice many times. Sometimes social justice, criminal justice, economic justice, political justice, racial justice. Justice means just or right action, the quality of being fair and just. On the third Monday in January, we celebrate Martin Luther King Jr. Day. He was a person who worked hard to bring justice to the world. He is known as the drum major for justice. That means he tried to help people who were treated unfairly. Unfairness and injustice exist all over the world. Hitting, hurting others, stealing, cheating, denying people equal opportunities, name-calling, dishonesty, taking advantage of others, teasing, leaving others out, treating others poorly. Those are all ways that people are treated unfairly. It hurts to be treated unfairly. And this makes God unhappy. It hurts to be treated unfairly. God wants us to be fair and just in everything that we do. The Bible says fairness should be like a river and goodness should be like a stream that never stops. We need to work hard to bring goodness that never stops and to wash away injustice in a river of fairness. What can we do to work for justice? We can, first of all, love God and have a heart for God, love others and ourselves. We can obey the golden rule, which means to treat others the way we want to be treated. We need to be kind and honest. Be active in our church and community. And that means singing on the choir, serving as an usher and or an acolyte, volunteering to assist others in programs in the community, such as community cleanup. Encourage and listen to others. If you see a problem or abuse, tell a trusted adult. Have a positive attitude. That's using positive words, thinking in a positive way. You can pray for justice and peace, and we can do something meaningful every day. God considers it an act of worship to live justly. Be fair in your work and your play. We can all make a difference, whether we're young or old, and we can bring about positive change, and then justice and fairness will roll on and never fail. And we have to always remember that love conquers all. Thank you.